Building a USB 3.1 host for certification is challenging. For you to build a super robust host for your customers is even more challenging. Your customers and end users expect your host to be able to connect to the cheapest $2 mouse, USB docking stations, $10 keyboards, 4K webcams, and super fast USB 3.1 SSDs. They expect to be able to use that SSD continuously while plugging and unplugging all kinds of devices all the time. Here at Synopsys in Mountain View, we've implemented our USB 3.1 host in an FPGA platform with our 3.1 FinFET Phi. The entire system is connected to a PC running Windows 10. The system runs standard USB drivers. We start by connecting to a webcam and we do that through a hub and then a connection exerciser from MCCI. In this case, you can see in the background the video is coming on and off. That's simulating the plugging and unplugging, the connect and disconnect. And you can see that it, it continues to connect properly, focus, and then disconnect each time. That simulates plugging and unplugging different devices. Then for the second part, we connect to a 3.1 Gen 2 uh, SSD. Uh, and we're actually running at 7 gigabits per second here. Of course, our, our, as you've seen from our earlier videos, we can run up to 10 gigabits per second. So we can continue to run full throughput so you can be transferring data, doing a backup, streaming videos from this drive, while connecting and disconnecting from a web, in this case a webcam, 4K webcam, or that could easily be a flash drive, keyboards, mice, printer, whatever you're plugging and unplugging from your system. This is one of the ways that Synopsys tests its USB 3.1 host controller and PHY in a system for robustness. So that when you put RIP into your chip, your users can have the best possible experience. Thanks for watching.